wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening. There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much-anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled. An atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. To what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4 3 3. Well, one of the attacking advantages in this setup, Peter, is the impact that can be made between fullbacks and the attacking wide players. These combinations, when worked well, can be a real handful for any opposition, and we're likely to witness that again. You often see the wide man drift inside to allow the fullback to make the run out wide, and it can just throw the opposition off kilter. we go then Auxerre were imperious when the two sides last met and the fans are asking for more of the same and he's whipped it in low and it's played forward and here's Balotelli first effort on goal well it was hit with great power Peter but sadly not great precision Hoisted clear. Played out to the right. Could cross it here. Bont gets good distance on it. And it's Ribery. Oh, that's nice. Shoots! Oh, that's a fine save! The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Great lead! As soon as they made that error in midfield, they didn't have time to react before the ball hit the net. Very much a lesson learned. Uxair have an early lead. Good start. Plenty waiting in the middle. Jose Font. And he's there to cut it out. Maori hoists it forward. Neil have made it clear what they're trying to do for me, Peter. What are they trying to do? Well, I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into, into better supply routes. Place it over to the other flank. Bradaric did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. And it's been given away. Maori drives it forward. Up to meet it! It's gone a long way up and away. Maori. Pied. 
Hardly anything between the sides. And the score is 1-0. Tries to get it forward quickly. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Out to the left it goes. Renato Sanchez. Renato Sanchez gets it out to the wing. And we've reached half time. So there you have it. A close sport half of football. But it still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A decent game up tonight. Well, that certainly pleased the fans, and the players are definitely happy with that scoreline. The question is now, can they protect it? Auxerre head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. Gets things going for the second half. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the... Has a hit! Oh, just couldn't quite turn it in. Auxerre can defend those situations better by stopping the cross at its source. Balotelli gets himself into trouble and he's lost it. And here's Ribéry. Oh, great ball! All the balls come loose! He's making good use of his strength there. Just refuses to be out. He's tried one! Oh, fine stop from the keeper. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra-sharp. Over to the left. Oh, Yazidji! Goal! Nil! They have hauled themselves right back into it. Patelli reacted well to the initial effort, but couldn't get it right out of the danger area. Well, look, regardless of whether the keeper could have done better or not, Peter, that was all down to the excellent movement in getting into the right position to apply the final touch. has certainly made things interesting. Look, get your seatbelts on because this is showing all the signs of another roller coaster ride. And it's Ribery. And helps available out wide. He proceeds it all the way. He's played him through. Big chance! Oh, that wasn't easy. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. Yazici. Yazici tries to switch the play. Time for a change in personnel. That'll be a throw in. The referee has given a corner. Radaric knocks it away. And the ball's come out. And he's there to clear it. Lille merit full marks for their attitude. And that little doubt, that is a foul. I gave him a decision to make, Peter. Concede the foul or expose his keeper to a one-on-one -on -one encounter.
that is a bit special. Uxair, take the lead. Oh, it was a long time coming, but I think it's fully merited. They've applied themselves extremely well. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. There's going to be another change here. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? Ribéry. Ribéry. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. Oh, that's a booking, always looked it. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. Oxer. And that will be the final act. Oxer, him on the final day. Thoughts on what we've just seen? Well, look, Peter, no matter what the circumstances, in my career there was always a call for ending the season on a winning note, go out on a high. And then, obviously, a more forensic reflection could begin on, on what needs to be altered during the process. So, just time for me to say thanks to Jim for his wisdom and to wish you all a very good evening.